All right, welcome back to Savannah Techie. I'm your host, Rafael Ndwiga. If you're new to the channel, kindly subscribe and like um, our videos and share them with your peers. Now, in the last in the, in the last video, we looked at how to install VirtualBox and also install Vagrant. And we even uh, switched into, uh, into the into the virtual environment that um, that was created by Vagrant. Now, in this tutorial, what we did not show is how to exit, uh, how to exit uh, from SSH. So, um, let me restart the process again and say to launch a, a Vagrant. So, first of all, to launch Vagrant, we we'll use the Vagrant app command, and you have to be in the directory uh, whereby uh, Vagrant is uh, Vagrant is installed. So let me close this partial and navigate to that directory. So there, we were in the test directory. All right, click, open partial uh, using the context menu. And from here, uh, <clears throat> from here, I'll wait for, for partial to, to finish launch up. And then we will we run the command uh, vagrant status to check the current status of our vagrant, so whether it's running or not. Uh, vagrant status. So vagrant status will tell us whether the virtual whether we have uh, the virtual machine running. So vagrant status there. Um, if I open my virtual box. You can see that it it's running here. Yeah. So I expect that the command vagrant status will tell me that the that the that the VM uh, with the config files, this particular config file that is currently that is currently running. And then I'll search back to uh, I'll search back into this VM. Okay, VM is virtual machine. And then once there, I will exit um vagrant okay so I'll come out of the search and then i'll also um i'll also stop this machine from running okay uh taking a little some time so i'm going to pause and uh, continue once uh this command gives me an output all right so uh, the command vagrant status has given uh, is indicating that the virtual uh, the, the, that the that the vm is running so let's just switch back to uh, to the vm using the command vagrant uh, ssh and if, if part of vagrant ssh doesn't work for you it may give you an error and one of the cases could be that you uh, that the open search package has not um, the open search package or software has not been installed on the machine. So you could you can install it using um, CY. So you can check on the previous tutorial on how to actually uh, set up everything to be just the way um, mine is right now. So if successful success back to um, to a Linux box. Now to get out of uh, to get out of SSH, use the command exit. So type exit, hit enter. And before we exit, you can see here it tells me we are in background, and uh, and this is the host the host name of the machine. So if I type exit, you can see it has logged out, and it has closed the connection to the it has closed the connection. To the box and you're back to our directory now since the box is still running uh, you can see here still it's still running now I'll use the command vagrant alt to, uh, to power off the to power off the the vagrant box so i can click here you can see this is running so i expect this machine to be to be shut down Okay, so I'm going to give it a few moments. 
uh, for that to actually happen. So you can see that uh, the, the the command vagrant halt has completed running, okay, and I can also confirm that uh, the machine has been has been has been shut down by going to my virtual box, and you can see that now the the VM that the VM has been that the VM has been switched off, okay. So the VM has been switched off. Um, if you like the video, kindly give me thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, kindly subscribe and tune in for more content from us. Thank you for watching.